My name is Rassi. I'm the manager for our entrepreneurship programs at ISS of BC. This is like the smartest move that our leadership team has ever made is bringing all our entrepreneurship programs together, including Smart Move. And what I love and I'm very proud of like our team is that collaborative spirit. And when I think of an example of how everyone works together in helping our newcomer immigrants like start their businesses, and also supporting the small businesses in Vancouver, in BC, fill their open job positions through our Smart Move program. So we have a business club that runs uh, monthly, and uh, with that, we bring in a guest speaker, and it will give an opportunity to our newcomer entrepreneurs to learn how to network in Canada and how to build and expand on your network. That is the one thing I'm very proud of, and it's all because of the collaborative spirit in our entrepreneurship programs and our staff, our team. It is super exciting. So ISS the BC leadership team, this is the best move you ever made. I believe uh, uh, maintaining the relevancy and uh, the effectiveness of the program is crucial, especially in a dynamic business landscape. We are constantly um, seeking feedback from clients, uh, volunteers and mentors who are taking part in our program. Uh, to be able to identify um, real-time challenges and opportunities. The one that motivated me to join the entrepreneurship program of ISSBC are the success stories of those who were in the program before. Good afternoon, my name is Alal Jamal. I'm a um, Spark and Ignite program uh, client, who, which is provided by ISS of BC. Through this program, by end of each session, and uh, I finish every task in Spark, I get closer to my goal. As yeah, service assistant, assessing the client's eligibility is fulfilling, knowing that we work with purpose. I'm a service assistant for the Spark and Ignite program, mainly Spark. And my favorite part of the role is during the client intake process, which is when I get to know the clients, get to know um, the best way that I can help them. And by doing that, I'm able to find out the best program that I can direct the client for. And it's really great for, to help the entrepreneurship team because when I do the client intake, I find out what the client, what are the needs, if he has any specific requests or what is he needing for the programs. And it's great for us to be able to know later if it worked or not. I met very wonderful people in ISS of BC where uh, they uh, enrolled me in a program called Spark where I work on different uh, learning modules to how to establish a business, what is a business, what is a business plan and how to how to do a market research and then I, I graduated from that program and then I enrolled in Ignite program where I found very wonderful people, they, they, they coach me and they train me how to develop a business idea, from where to start, how to do in-depth uh, market research, where the legal uh, advice can I get from, uh, so this all in marketing and finances and stuff like that. We facilitate the growth of our entrepreneurs by connecting them with different resources. We have uh, we have number of mentors within our uh, ecosystem of support. We focus on our clients' needs and uh, what they need. Depending on that, we connect them with the right resources within our program. Since the start, they have been very helpful and I am finding their networking events and uh, regular conversations with their uh, business support personnel, very beneficial. I have a client who have been, uh, been in silence for a few months. So in spite of voicemails, emails and calls, I, don't have, I did not receive any reply. The last thing I, I did is sent a message with a combination of a business-like manner and a little personal touch that say, how are you? I'm here. I'm open to listen to you. And whatever challenges you have, please feel free to contact me. And after I sent a message, I received a call. So I listened actively to the client as she shared her challenges. And before we ended up our conversation, I, I told her some motivations, some encouragement, some advices that she can face the challenges she get. I am here to support. And she said, what is the next? That's a good sign that the client is ready. 
I'm so thankful for everyone at ISS of BC for the service that they uh, provide me with uh, from the first day that I moved uh, to Canada. Um, I'm so happy to be a part of this program and be part of ISS of BC community. One of my clients had a very unique technical uh, innovation in, for, in vertical farming and based on listening and understanding their problem, understanding where they want to go, we were able to guide them in acquiring IP, in acquiring a strategic business approach to the new business that he would like to launch. I really enjoy uh, a YouTube video that talked to me, that show how they can guide you and give you access to certain resources that help you develop your program. There was a client who is a mom and she had to stop uh, looking for a job here and there for over six months because of the family issue and that the timing wasn't right and then she didn't get uh, uh, responses from the companies as well. But then she came to us and then we helped her to uh, revise her resume and then using AI technology and then also we helped her to improve her interview skills uh, with our AI simulation program and then within a couple of weeks we were able to match her with uh, one of the uh, tech companies in Canada. Um, this organization has helped me a lot in um, establishing my business because as a newcomer in Canada of course I don't know the requirements, the steps, the process, how to build a business and they are strong support system that I have found through referral of friends. With the networking and connecting with the mentors in the industries related to their business idea, we help them to make uh, educated decisions in their entrepreneurship journey. Uh, at ISS of BC, we work with purpose and we love helping others. Uh, I would say that as an immigrant myself, it's, um, it's a great opportunity, it's a great feeling to help others, especially because I know that it's quite a challenge when you move, move countries, you have a new reality, a new career to build. And we are here, here to support people from everywhere uh, around the world. And it's a pleasure to welcome everybody. It's from immigrants to other immigrants.